no more. Like, no more. I can't. I don't know. It's so weird. But yet, like I said, what do I know? People love to watch these train wrecks. Yeah, these people. Who, I don't know. Maybe he's not a train wreck. It seems like he's doing well financially. But it's just, he's not. It's fake. It's not interesting. I just, hey, I'm going to make it real. Look, here, I'm going to propose and. Oh, whoops, here's my McLaren. I was just kind of like, yeah, so, okay. Yeah. Yeah, fancy car, and what? Like, hey, baby, will you marry me? I don't care. I don't care if she says yes, I don't care if she says no. It's none of my business. I'm, I'm uninteresting. I have to get all angles. I can't, I can't believe what I'm hearing right now. You can't believe it? No, I'm just you... kidding. I've heard a lot of him uh, complaining on this trip. You complain about me, like, messing stuff up and being clumsy. I do yeah, a lot of ranting. <laughs> the day's not complete till we have a, a Shannon moment. You know my eyesight sucks right now. Yeah, you, you told me your eyesight sucks. Yeah, you just don't understand. Um, I haven't complained about it. The only time I mention it is where you complain about me dropping or running into something, which still has nothing to do with you. No, it has nothing to do with me. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you can run into as many things as you like. And I do. Yeah. Oh yeah. I think we've I think we've dropped more energy drinks and on the ground more energy <laughs> casualties than we've actually drank. So every time we open there, oh, oh, there goes that. I'm gonna get the car. Ah, oh, my head. Oh, what did I drop? Oh no, I think I left something. Oh. Yeah, what I is did this? lose my oh, camera. Ah, no. Oh, it's just that's I'm just kind of like. But here I am just like, I don't know, nothing's fine on my end, nothing's happening and, here. And nothing's fine on mine either, that's just a, a reaction people have, just a natural reaction. It's just like a little angry storm cloud. That's just no, I'm, just, I'm not angry, <laughs> I'm okay. It's it's you complaining about it. I'm, I'm not, I'm just an observer. You're like, oh, Shannon's so clumsy, the day's not over until she ruins something, breaks I'm something, loses I something. I'm just coming, I you know, I have no stake in the outcome. You can drop, you cannot drop, but... I'll drop it like it's hot. Only no. if I don't have to pick it up after. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Yeah, but you're the one that's complaining about it, not me. I'm not complaining. I'm just an observer. No, you're complaining. Oh, he, he just complains and whines all day long. All day long. Go ahead. Okay. Be honest. I'm, I'm just right all day long and I think it annoys him. Okay. What about the dear diary? So I write in my diary every time I'm right. So you, so I mean, it's, it's a long empty. diary. It's pretty dusty and <laughs> <laughs> this is my diary. I write down the times I've been right. <laughs> so, hey, but this, di this thing's empty. <laughs> No, it's not. And this is the diary right, right? I, what happened in the day? Whoa, <laughs> who's this Ryan guy? It's just a lot of, he's right all the time. What's all this? I, I don't write in my diary about Ryan. He wishes. I wouldn't either. It's just, uh. You wouldn't write about you in your diary? I wouldn't write, no, I'd be embarrassed. There's a whole diary just back. So I talked to Ryan again today and uh, he was right. And then, uh. No. Yeah. Oh, right again. Right again. It's just like after a while, it's just kind of like, geez. It's kind of repetitive. Kind, kind of like when we went kayaking and you're like, I'm thirsty. And I was like, you should bring water. And then we get out there. Oh, we need to hurry back. I'm thirsty. Yeah. While we're crawling into the kayak, I was like, hmm, maybe we should bring water. And then Shannon goes, hey, I got, I got an idea. What if we like brought some water and, and like while my, I'm already you sitting did. in it. And then I was like, well, you know, whatever. And, you know, we'll just go off like an hour and then I'll come back. And then we're out there. She goes, yeah, you know, we should have probably brought some water. <laughs> And that was my idea, okay? And yeah. I'm like, we're, I'm like, we're already like out in the ocean or whatever. And I was just like, uh, yeah, I mentioned that when we we're sitting in the kayak, already like leaving, like we're like we're leaving the dock. You should have prepared. And, uh, I told you at the time. I car. said it. I yeah, you said it after he, I did. You're like a parrot. <laughs> <laughs> I said it. <laughs> water, water. It's like yeah, I said water. We're <laughs> water. I was like, well, you, you stop copying me. And then she goes, ah, I said remember. Yeah. You, I told you to bring water. <laughs> I remember when I said it first. He was the thirsty one. I was fine. Yeah, that's really weird. What's really well, weird? not really, because I mean, I guess I was doing most of the work. So. No, you were not. And it was hot. And then, well, 
that, yeah, that was weird how you weren't even like, uh, you weren't even like hot and you're wearing your Sunday best. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never hot. I told you. You went out in your, uh. I was wearing a dress. Yeah. There you go. Wearing a dress. like. I was wearing a dress because, like I said, I didn't want my legs to get sunburned. In a dress, you can either pull up or pull down depending on, like, how, I didn't know if we were going to be out there for two hours. I was prepared. It's it's a maxi dress. That's what girls wear on the beach. They wear it over their swimsuits. I just wasn't wearing a swimsuit underneath. I don't know. Where I was are, very confused by it. There's nothing to be confused by. It's a dress. I don't um, have clothing. It's okay. Like we were talking about earlier, I I like I like interesting things. So wearing a dress while kayaking, you go for it. You go, girl. You wear that dress. Oh, don't ever say that again. <laughs> <laughs> you wear that dress. I I did wear that dress. You did, and I and it got all wet. And it wasn't yeah. supposed to get. I would have, to be honest, I would have stayed dried the entire time. But there was something horrible out in the water that day that splashed me. His name is Ryan. You splashed me. You splashed me, and then you said something like, "Yeah, yeah, you like." It. And I said, "Hey, don't you know? Don't start something you don't know how to finish." And then. Uh, <laughs> Just kind of, <laughs> and then suddenly, <laughs> I summoned forth like a giant tsunami on her. <laughs> That's not even what I sound Why? like. Why? He makes up Why? these things. He makes it sound like I'm. And then some she tries to whiner and complain. The worst and I'm thing. Not. And then she starts to try and she always tries to make it in like a woman's thing. Yeah, I'm gonna show people how you abuse women. I was like, what? Like, what does that do with women? It's like oh. fishing for allies. Like you're just saying, eh, "Come on, girls, right, right." <laughs> it's like, no, that was you. This is, this is not to do with women. Like, what are you talking about? Like, you splashed me, and then I, I told you, you're, you're gonna get splashed if you keep doing that. That's fine, <laughs> and that's fine. And, and then, I, I no, I wore the wet dress. I wore it to the store you buying did. all your groceries. I didn't complain once. Not once. I never complain. He's just trying to say this for, I don't know, comedic effect, and it's really not funny. Because everyone that knows me knows I'm not a complainer, and I make everything work, even a dress kayaking. I'm not going to be like everyone else wearing swimsuits, complaining about it being hot and stuff. You can wear whatever you want. And I do. Good. I can wear dresses while hiking. Absolutely. And sandals and stuff. You can wear whatever you want. I know. I don't need your permission. Where? No, I don't know. Like I said, I like the interesting things. I like looking at it going, okay. <laughs> why, do, why do you have to look at me like that? Why can't it you makes just... life interesting. If everyone was the same, that's what we were talking about earlier. If everyone was the same, life would be boring. You want people to be different. Yeah, but you don't have to, like, judge me for it. I... I think it's great. I hope you wear the dress everywhere. I think you should wear the dress. And we'll go in the ocean, and you just go. I in would. Dress. I would. I would wear this in the in the ocean. Fantastic. Let's do it. Whenever we go in the ocean, actually, we're not gonna have much time because I think we're leaving the ocean pretty soon. Well, it's, hold on. We're leaving the ocean, and I brought like 15 swimsuits, and I didn't get to wear one of them. I'm recording you. It's been a half hour of, of him complaining. Really? Yep. Oh, God. Half hour. This has not been interesting. You, you're going to have to trim it down to whatever you like, which is just Probably deleted. Like I agree. Yeah. Um. I, I saw a sign back there that said eight miles, and that was probably like four miles back. So cool. To Clinton. Yay! We're almost here. And I have not seen anything beautiful. What was beautiful In about this island? Mile, turn right onto Cultus Bay Road. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, let me stop. What was beautiful supposed to be beautiful about this island? I don't know. I was told this island is going to be beautiful. Oregon has been disappointing. Oregon? Oregon? No, Washington. Oh, wait. You caught me. Washington has been disappointing. Oregon was freaking awesome. He can't stop thinking about Oregon ever since they pumped his gas. Turn right onto Cultus Bay Road. Now you keep mentioning the gas. Because I have to because I wake up in the morning. It's like, you want to see my gas video? And I go to sleep at night. Hey want to watch the gas video or I just hear it playing I hear me talking I'm like is he watching that gas video and of course I hear I love the law 
You sent me, you like freaking showed me the gas video like a day ago. I have watched it so many, I think it has like probably 50 views. Really? Well, we're going viral. No, it has one view. We could, and you know what everyone's gonna say? That guy's so fake. He knew the law in Oregon. He set himself up for it. Watch the video, decide for yourself. What do you think, America? <laughs> gonna agree with me look at this face like and subscribe i'm so innocent <laughs> isn't that the most annoying thing <laughs> like and subscribe like and subscribe like everyone says that at the end of their video like and subscribe like please please give me what? the likes and the subscribe i think if you really like it you just do it you know you don't have to ask will you please uh, could you please could you please like and subscribe we still have an hour really before like we can it. check in oh crap so what are we gonna do continue on Colton's bay road there's like three miles. nothing to do like no hiking. I thought I was gonna do. We could try a, and figure out a place tomorrow. A two. Oh, okay. I thought I was gonna go on a two mile hike and it being point two miles, the longest hike ever. Litter and it will hurt. Did you see that sign? That's threatening. What? Litter and it will hurt. And it said report violator. Boo! Boo Washington! I need to get the hell out of this state. Boo! I don't like that. That's an invitation to be a rat, a dirty rat. Bye. Report someone. Call 1-800-RAT on your fellow man. <laughs> yes! If they're littering, that's... That's a rat. That means, this... that, that means watch of a police people. Well, yes. Like, I'm watching you. I'm watching you. This is uh, why lady. I wanted out of California, because it looks like trash. What? You want to live in trash? Yeah. I'm going to tell on... I'm going to tell on someone that's littering. You are? You're going to be a rat. You want to be a rat. You want to be like Tattletail? I really think you need to hold a wrapper out outside of the window stitches. to see what happens. Huh? Snitches get stitches. By who? By who? Uh, the people that you rat on. Rat, you'll find out. No. The I'm cats will come after you. Being a good person. If I witness something... That's like if I witness a real crime. Like, a, I mean, littering is a crime. But like a, a really... Like someone's getting hurt, am I supposed to be like, oh no, I can't rat on them and just let them keep hurting people? No. Are you gonna do something about it? There's signs everywhere. But you saying, don't know who started the dispute. You see two people punching each other. Who do you save? Whoever's gonna looks like they're dying. The loser? It could be the what loser. What if that freaking the loser could be the hero. started the fight? Whoever, and then you punch out the winner. War is not is not the answer. I yeah, would, well, see, you're gonna you're trying to pick a fight in something that you don't, you don't even understand. I'm just trying to stop the fight. I'm not trying to pick a fight. Well, I'm a said, lover, not said a fighter. You were gonna break it up, and you were gonna side with the loser. I'm not gonna side with anyone, but I'm gonna stop. So, okay, so you see two people dying. punching each other. Who do you save? Myself, and not get not get in the middle. Oh, <laughs> well, that's almost like what I just said. Oh, whoa. Interesting how like her, did you see? She just jumps around. <laughs> like you go, hey, what is your stance on? Well, this minute it's this. Ask me again in a minute and I will have a completely different opinion. It's, it's just jerk. like, what the heck is that? I'm fighting for the loser. And then I ask her a minute later, I just don't want to get involved. Right. It's none of your business. It's like two people are fighting. It's like, you, yeah, that sucks. You but it's like, asked but me. I don't know who's morally justified. Maybe they're both jerks. Maybe one of them, yeah, is well, getting trouble. Well, they probably I don't are. Know, I just feel like it's none of your business. It's like are these? It is none of my business. That's why I don't even notice people. Those two people could be fighting and I wouldn't even notice. Oh my goodness. Look at you. See, now you've become like, you're, you're toning things out. I think I, actually that might be I've good always thing. done that. Always. Well, Everyone's like, look at that person. Look at this. And I'm like, oh where? So what? So now she's changed again. Now it's gone from, <laughs> I'm going to help the loser to, I see it, but I just don't want to get involved. To, I don't see nothing. <laughs> so I wonder what she'll uh, You asked me if I saw something. I'll have to and ask I'm her again telling in a you, I don't. She says. I'm telling you, I don't see stuff because I filter everything out. But you said if you saw something. So that means I noticed it. Knowing me, though, I would not notice it because I don't. You're just listening. out the violence. You see two listening. people fighting and you just like... Well, if they're slapping you, I think... In a quarter mile, turn left onto Glendale Road. Glendale? I'm back in Glendale. Oh, no. Washington sucks. Yeah, Washington, uh, it's kind of a bust. Well, yeah, this wasn't worth coming to the island for, to be honest. It wasn't. Like, Washington I didn't see anything pretty at all. average at best. Turn left onto Glendale Road. We should have. This is Adobe. Yeah, this isn't. That's Glendale. 
Uh, yeah, we should have uh, uh, just gone to Montana where the hot guys are. Continue on Glendale Road for one mile. I think, well, I think Utah is where the pretty girls are. Utah? Or Ro no, it's Rhode Island. It's they have Rhode they have the most nasty looking men, but the beautiful girls, according to Google. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that'd probably be a good place for me to go then. Yeah, because you have no competition then, because all the men are disgusting. Ew. So all the women will want you until I show them these videos of what a woman hater you are. Oh no! See there she goes again. Come on, girls, right? <laughs> right? Huh? I'm such a nice girl, uh, and he tries to make it seem see, like I could just I'm turn it the other him. way. I could just go. See, look, she's being so mean to me, right, guys? Right? <laughs> Look and at then, her. She's and getting then, up okay, on me. Why does she hate men? Let's be honest. Okay, guys. I woke up this morning at 4 in the morning, went worked out, and then I made him breakfast. I make him breakfast every single morning. I did his laundry for three hours yesterday while he took a nap. Because she also did her own laundry. I was driving all day yesterday. No, Wait, no, hold no, on. No, make sure, Shannon, I'm not make done. sure you hear the whole story. I'm, no, I'm not done. Shannon brought she, a bag big enough that I didn't have to do laundry. Shannon, I, I sometimes I do like six hour, seven hour drives and then I'm like, hey, I'm feeling a little tired. Oh, someone needs a nap. Well, fine. I guess I'll just have to go. Quarter mile whatever. I worked out. I guess out. I'll do the laundry. I did laundry and worked out. But she also does her out. own laundry. Well, but it's of like, course. Because you know. he only brought like seven things to wear. So I, I'm not going to waste water by not doing a full load. I'm thinking about the environment here. Now, yeah. I'm not about to waste my time. If I'm going to do something, it better benefit me. Oh, my God. Look at that. That's so selfish. That I am like selfish. Like, oh, my God. <laughs> Why do you hate men so much? I don't. I love men. Oh. I just can't wait to find one. <laughs> oh my god. I know, it's all she talks about. And that comes back. Yeah. That takes us back to the tarot readings. No. It's all like... Uh, that, that's what takes us back to going to Montana. There's some guy out there who may or may not be thinking of you. Who oh, may they, or may not are. be a man. They are. They are. You may have met, maybe not have met. Turn left onto uh, Andy Road. This is actually a really pretty trail here. What kind of road? What? What road is this named? I don't know. But what? yeah, then Ryan just likes to make Swanson fun of me all day. Sometimes? Just wait till he has nothing to eat. I'm I cooked for him last night at midnight after he took his three hour long nap, and I and went. And she apologizing. I'm sorry it took so long. Because no blah. one should have to eat at twelve. That's sad. It was pretty sad. But I was tired. I drove a long time. I said I'm gonna lay down and maybe I'll nap. He maybe drove I won't. Two hours. So then I. No, well, not oh. even. Oh, do you want me to pull up the trip? How I know what would have been gone for ten days? How many miles I've driven? What I think three thousand. Oh, oh, you want to bring up how many hours I've slept? Uh, whoa. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's do that. <laughs> yeah. Let's talk about. Okay. Okay. Before we even leave on the trip, she's mm -hmm. like sleeps like one hour a night and stuff. And then we come out here, and then she tries to use that against me. I didn't. I slept I didn't. two hours last night. Like, yeah. <laughs> And, like, that's no different than you always tell me. You're but like, I'm getting hey, I slept a lot more stuff. That's really good. And then, like, now suddenly she goes, I only slept two hours. She's like, that's your fault. And I'm like, it's up two hours before we left, before I even, like, you know, I'm doing like, a lot more. I was by I was myself. Like, uh, I, didn't, I wasn't cooking changed. and doing, I wasn't doing a ton of laundry. I, I wasn't cooking. I think she cooking. needs to donate her, her body to science because Shannon lives on no sleep and no food, and that's fascinating i think we could study her we could learn a lot because sleep is a waste of time i mean it's like you sleep away a 30 life not if you're shannon if you're shannon you only sleep <laughs> I away don't waste uh, any time. yeah probably I, about like a 12th i waste of your my life. life cooking for ryan and doing his laundry oh, okay and i waste my life driving for shannon and listening to her <laughs> complaining about me driving and yeah i don't complain about, uh, you're the complainer i'm happy all the time even when i run into things and drop things i'm happy you're the one that's like mm -hmm, life sucks what the? I didn't say that. You're you're implying it. Uh, what? Yeah. I, like you're yeah. complaining. Washington sucks. No one is here to pump my gas. I'm over Washington. I think that was. Hey, wait a minute. Which way is this? Here we go. Eleven days of this. I thought it said straight. I know this thing's kind of saying go left. I don't even know why we're getting here so early. We have an hour. Oh, we have Wi-Fi here. We can figure out where we're going next. Somewhere simple. Road drive so you use turnouts. Oh, okay, I guess I am still on the right road. Except we have that kind of like got a dead end. This is a pretty little drive, but I really feel. I feel like it looks just like how it did when we were in North.
Northern California. I feel like it's uh, very secluded. I like that. Yeah, I do too. Ryan will die in the woods and no one will know. Bear got him or something. I don't know. I could even I could even say an alligator got him and people would believe me. <laughs> there was this wild alligator out off the island in Washington. It just came up and ate his body whole. Like a chicken nugget. I'll probably just stand there staring at you like <laughs> blinking. <laughs> I can say anything. A wild elephant came and stomped him into the ground and just created dust and it blew away. In 600 feet, your destination will be on the left. Okay. The left? But yeah, we'll see how this goes. We have, how many more days did we count? 16? 16 more days. I have, to, 15? Like I have to poke with Ryan for that many more days. I'm almost halfway there. I might make it. Maybe. But Ryan's having the time of his life. He's so happy all day. Look at you. She just said I'm like miserable and hopeless and now suddenly she goes, I need to happy. You, you are, you are, you are. Shannon, and I'm trying to Shannon, fix him. Yeah, this may be the last time you see Shannon. Shannon is becoming a self-collapsing vortex of hypocrisy. She's eventually just going <laughs> to suck into nothing. Too much hypocrisy. <laughs> and then I'll just like, where'd she go? She was here a second ago. She just collapses into like nothing. <laughs> Creates this vortex of just hypocrisy. Just collapses in upon herself. She's like... I'm supposed to it? make. I think this is it. I'm supposed to make the trip fun. I try to listen to music for just an hour, and he's like, "Why are you listening to music?" I and said, then I, I heard, I heard I it you, for like two weeks. I didn't know what you're listening. I was like, "Oh, why do you have headphones on?" Oh, this is it. Oh, okay. And then I just, I don't know. I let her listen to music. I'm like, playing it. Oh, okay. And that like, was it. You thought it was the weirdest thing ever. But, well, no. I was just like, "What are you doing?" And I was like, "Oh, you listen to music." I was like, "Oh, okay." And that was it. And I was like, "All right." And then, like, I don't know, she's like, hey, you care, listen to music. I was like, oh, actually, I don't care. Oh, good, good, I'll do it more. Yeah, I was like, fine, I don't care, I'm listening to whatever you want. Okay. I have it on video. off my sex. Here. Hello. Now, I don't know what to do now that we are here. Yeah, we have an hour. We're too early.